Yo, what is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joe King Johnson before, and today we're going to be talking about the Sunday night's game, which was between the Indianapolis Colts versus the Denver Broncos. Now, I want to start from one side, though. We're going to be starting off from the Denver Bron Broncos' point of view. Now, in the first quarter, Denver Broncos were dominating. They were, like, all over the place. They were ready to play. They looked like a championship defense and offense, especially with Peyton Manning. God damn, that guy was leading the troops. Now, the thing that really kind of caught my eye with the Denver Broncos is that they get way too confident. They get way too confident. They start to celebrate way too early. And that's what almost killed them in the second half. I mean, we all saw how the Indianapolis Colts almost pulled off a comeback. Why do comebacks happen? Because the opposite team who's routing the enemy is pretty much getting way too confident, way too comfortable that they tend to slack off. And that's what I saw from the Denver Broncos. They started to slack off. All these young guys, all these guys who have like under four years of pro starting on the Denver Broncos, they get they got a little bit too confident. And that's where they got a lot of miscues going on. On defense and on offense. I even saw it from the O-line. I'm surprised even from the O-line, these guys were not pushing back. So, it's either that or the Indianapolis Colts really, really tried so hard, but... What I saw the most is the Denver Broncos got a little bit way too confident. And that's what they need, really need to work on. Because if they don't work on it, I might as well see another Super Bowl between the Seattle Seahawks and the Denver Broncos. Which was a final score of, a, of 8 and 48 or some kind of a score like that. But it was disgusting. That was the worst game of all time. I mean, come on. How can you be rotted that much in the Super Bowl? And against the Seattle Seahawks, by the way, so... Yeah, I don't want that to happen. So the Denver Broncos got to keep that mentality strong. Because if they don't, we're going to be seeing another Seattle Seahawks game in the Super Bowl. So this is what another thing that I believe, guys. I don't think they can beat the 49ers. I don't think the Denver Broncos can beat the uh, New Orleans Saints. I don't think they can beat the Green Bay Packers with that kind of mentality. Because if they don't fix it, might as well lose those games. Cause that's th cause, because those kinds of games are big. And if you don't keep the same mentality that you that you had in the beginning with all that success, you might as well fail. Okay, okay, I see so these guys gotta be consistent, man. That's all I'm saying. The Denver Broncos could be a great team and go 16 and 0, maybe beat the Patriots actually, you know, record. But you know, I don't know. The Denver Broncos are still gonna go to playoffs though with a high record. I think they're gonna lose, just lose three games, and that's it because they don't keep that winning mentality. Now, moving on with the Indianapolis Colts. So what I saw about the Indianapolis Colts is that they actually want to win. The only problem that I see with the Indianapolis Colts in, the, in this game between the Denver Broncos and, and, the, and the Colts was that the running back was not doing anything. Trent Richardson is still a big problem, though. That guy can't even go over three yards sometimes. I feel bad for him because, you know, he has a good size to be a running back. It's just that he ain't pushing it, man. He runs into his own O-line. He doesn't find the holes. He just runs straight. He just knows he knows the route, but he's gonna keep on running, even though there's a hole open somewhere else. He doesn't be. He doesn't. He's not creative when running the, the goddamn ball. So I suggest like to think about it. The Indianapolis Colts need to draft a better running back. They do, or they use a more Bradshaw more or something because without a running game. Because if you're if you're passing too much and they stop your passing, and all you can do is run, and all you had is Trent Richardson, how do you expect to gain yards? So that's what I saw from the first half. You know, they stopped the passing, so might as well run. But Trent Richardson can't get that far. I mean, I think they would have done better with the other guy they used to have with Donald. I think that's that's his first name. And um, I don't know, the Indianapolis Colts they really do have that want. Could have won the game. They actually could have won the game if they would have had, you know, better players uh, and better experience. Because we all know how Andrew Luck are, is and uh, T.Y. Hilton and Kobe Fleener. All these guys need experience. I think they're gonna make it to the playoffs, guys. They are gonna make it over the Texans. The record is either gonna be nine and seven or ten and six at the end of the season. I think it is. These guys are pretty good. And especially in the division. I mean, look at the division. Jaguars, Tennessee Titans, and the Texans. The Texans don't have a quarterback. They have Ryan Fitzpatrick. So pretty much we're going to see the Indianapolis Colts in the playoffs this year. With a 9-7 record or 10-6. I don't believe they're going to go over 10 wins. But 
hey they have the one they have some personnel developing around there so that's my opinion guys i think the indianapolis Colts could have won the game but the Denver broncos are in championship mode and uh, i believe they can actually make it to the afc championship but can they win it's up to them because the mentality from the denver broncos is quite different from the other nfl teams they get way too confident they needed somebody to like actually set the mood straight on that defense and offense on both sides Peyton Manning needs to step up more as a leader i think than a comedic genius like <laughs> that time that he danced in practice he needs to get a little bit of a you know a little bit of a you know order around there so so that's my opinion guys the indianapolis Colts will might will still make it to the playoffs the the broncos will actually make it to the afc championship a lot further than the indianapolis Colts. um so that that's pretty much my opinion guys if you guys want me to talk about some other games please let me know in the comment section if you guys want to see more um you know videos like these 